I'm finally about to get back into role playing after a very long period of not role playing. Uh, I just moved to Asheville, North Carolina, and there's a really nice little gaming store, and they're doing this thing called um, uh, Dungeon Dragons Encounters. So I joined up. Uh, Wednesdays, we're going to do a two hour session, something. It's like, I don't really know what D&D Encounters is. I'm sure someone does out there, but it's like a, a worldwide or nationwide, everybody's playing the same kind of adventure at the same time. But whatever, doesn't, that's not what I'm doing this for. But it got me thinking, thinking of my character and what he's going to be like. And it got me pondering about the, the different uh, hurdles of role playing. And the, one of the main ones I think uh, that probably most people have trouble with, myself included, is keeping your character ignorant. And uh, by ignorant, I don't mean stupid. I mean ignorant in the way that your character doesn't know the same knowledge that you personally know, maybe about everyone else, about the game. And this is a hard, um, hard aspect to keep, keep out of role playing. Because you may know that the character over there is actually scheming against you, but your character doesn't. And to try and keep that knowledge out of the game for your character is difficult. But it, uh, it definitely adds a lot if you can try and keep your character ignorant to the things that you, as the gamer, knows. I was just uh, putting it out there for uh, people to maybe come up with more things about uh, how it's uh, difficult, difficult situations in which to role play. And I would say that's one of the hardest, is keeping uh, player knowledge different than uh, character knowledge.